This beautiful October 10th Monday morning is chicken smackers or shrimp poppers. You can also choose an Italian sub sandwich with a side of mac and cheese. There is also fresh cauliflower, celery and peanut butter, and, a, and of course fruit and a milk. There are only four days left till fall break, so make each one count. You can sign up today in the guidance office or on October 6th through the 11th in the cafeteria. For people in National Honor Society, donating counts as school-sponsored hours. This will take place during school, and t-shirts are given to those who donate as well. And you can contact Ms. Wagner for any questions. Did you hear about the blood drive? What? No. What's a blood drive? <laughs> a blood drive is where you don donate blood to those in need, and our school is having one on October 19th. Oh, so anyone can donate? I'm failing all my classes and need help. Where do I go? I have just the answer for you. On Tuesdays and Thursdays in Miss Shipley's room after school, there's tutoring. Mm -hmm. And guess what? She has snacks, too. I love snacks. Brenda Lake plays 24th with a time of 24 minutes and 44 seconds. Brady Garrison placed 12th place with a time of 18 minutes and 34 seconds. Nate Lockridge placed 14th place with a time of 18 minutes and 44 seconds. Ryan Hubbard placed 16th place with a time 18 minutes 58 seconds. Just missing second team all conference, rounding out the top five was Jonathan Baxter placing 26 with a time of 19 minutes and 31 seconds. Yeah. First team all conference while Brady Garrison and Nate Lockbridge were second team all conference. Carter Hellenbrink placed fifth with a time of 18 minutes. Brady Garrison placed 12th with a time of 18 minutes and 34 seconds. Nate Lockridge placed 14th with a time of 18 minutes and 44 seconds. Ryan Hubbard placed 16th with a time of 18 minutes and 58 seconds. Just missing second team all co conference, rounding out the top five was Jonathan Baxter placing 26 with a time of 19 minutes and 31 seconds. This week, both teams will head into sectionals at Belmont on October 8th. Both teams are looking to advance out of sectionals and they are seated favorably. If they do advance to regionals, the girls will have advanced for four years straight and the guys will have advanced for the second year in a row. Oh no, our boat is sinking. If you want to save people too, talk to the U.S. National Guard. They'll be at lunch on October 18th. Something you didn't know about Miss Abbott. She used to be a welder. What's going on with Mr. Gibson? Well, he recently finished his eight year in the Dungeons and Dragons campaign. Continuing the teacher fun facts, Mrs. Richard was a cheerleader from grades 7 to 12. Have you thought about going to college yet, Vinny? I haven't, but I heard there are sign-up sheets for an Anderson College visit in the guidance office. When do you go? You will go on the 25th. Hey teachers, are there any fun events happening in your class? Mrs. Davis says to let her know if you're doing anything fun for the yearbook. Hey Colin, did you know October 13th is the end of the first nine weeks? Really? Better do your homework. If you have any awesome examples of how students are being kind, Mrs. Wagner would love to hear about them. Also, if you need a few extra tickets, let Mrs. Wagner know, as we have plenty of candy. Let's recognize some of our awesome students here at Woodland and encourage kindness. Teachers, our service club is participating in a kindness challenge for the month of October. Beginning next week, October 10th, we would like to recognize students in the act of going above and beyond to be kind to others. The service club has created laminated tickets that will be redeemable for candy in the guidance department. Mrs. Wagner will put a handful of these in each teacher's mailbox to distribute and award the kids. The service club members will also receive a stack of tickets to give out to other students. I hate my picture. Dang, bro, me too. Well, it's a good thing picture retakes are on October 20th. Hey, teachers, are there any fun events happening in your class? Mrs. Davis says to let her know if you're doing anything fun for the yearbook. The weather for Wednesday, October 12th, will be 48 degrees between 6 a.m. and 7 a.m. Be sure to bring a hoodie. And the high will be 74 degrees between 2 and 3 p.m. Thursday, October 13th. 
It'll be 42 degrees in the morning, and then after school it'll be a nice 69 degrees between 2 to 3 p.m. This is your weather for Monday, October 10th. For today's weather, there is sunshine and a little bit of clouds, and a slight chance of a rain shower. The high is around 65 degrees and a low of 45. Winds southwest at 5 to 10 miles per hour. This Saturday is cross-country sectionals and only seven varsity runners get to compete. So the fastest seven warriors this year get to run. We have strong one, two, three punch with Katie, May, and Kara. We then have a group of four with Riley Morgan, Brenna, and Grace that can run as a pack and work together to bring it home. We also have two alternatives as well with Bethany Lockridge and Alexis Smith who are able to step in and fill a spot should the need arise. Can they advance for the second year in a row and get another picture up on the Wall of Fame by the Women's Gym? We will know this Saturday. Also October 11th, girls varsity slash JV volleyball sectionals. Also, October 14th on Friday, varsity football at home against Adam Central, 7 p.m. Also, October 15th, Saturday, JV football at Adam Central at 10 p.m. The weather for Friday, October 14th is partly cloudy skies and 58 degrees. Let's hope for a fog delay. And there is no lunch because we don't have school. Have a fantastic fall break. Would you rather win an Olympic medal, an Academy Award, or the Nobel Peace Prize? Hello. <laughs> oh, Nobel Peace Prize. Comes with a cash prize and more notoriety. And that doesn't fade. Would you rather... It's good. It's fine. Would you rather win an Olympic medal... Olympic an medal. Academy Award... Olympic medal. Okay. <laughs> Olympic medal. Okay. Nobel Peace Prize. AGT. A Nobel Peace Prize. Um, Olympic. Would you rather win an Olympic medal? <laughs> <laughs> the Nobel Peace Prize. The Nobel Peace Prize. All of them. <laughs> 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 Uh, Olympic medal. I think I would rather win Jimmy's mom. I think I'm going to go with an Olympic medal. A message from Coach Thieving. Thursday night, the girls' soccer team beat Marion 4-0. Leah Hathaway led the way with two goals, one of them assist assisted by Ava McAlexander. Caitlin McAlexander had one goal assisted by Ellie Wilson. Austin Gass stole the ball and blasted, it, blasted our last goal. They will be playing in the sectional championship on Saturday. Also October 11th, girls varsity slash JV volleyball sectionals. Also October 14th on Friday, varsity football at home against Adam Central, 7 p.m. Also October 15th, Saturday, JV football at Adam Central at 10 p.m.